Chinese drone maker Ihang Incorporated on Wednesday unveiled what it calls the world's first drone capable of carrying a human passenger. The Guangzhou, China-based company pulled the cloth off the Ihang 184 at the Las Vegas Convention Center during the CES Gadget Show. In a company video showing it flying, it looks like a small helicopter but with four doubled propellers spinning parallel to the ground like other drones. The electric-powered drone can be fully charged in two hours, carry up to 220 pounds and fly for 23 minutes at sea level, according to Ihang. The cabin fits one person and a small backpack and even has air conditioning and a reading light. With propellers folded up, it's designed to fit in a single parking spot. After setting a flight plan, passengers only need to give two commands, take off and land, each controlled by a single click on a Microsoft Surface tablet, the company said. It is designed to fly about 1,000 to 1,650 feet off the ground with a maximum altitude of 11,500 feet and top speed of 63 miles per hour. U.S. authorities are just starting to lay out guidelines for drone use, and a human passenger drone seems certain to face strict scrutiny. Federal Aviation Administration Administrator Michael Werda was at CES but could not immediately be reached for comment through a spokesman. A Hank co-founder and chief financial officer Shang Shio said the company hopes to sell the device for $200,000 to $300,000 beginning this year but acknowledged it occupies a legal gray area. A passenger would have no controls as a backup, he said. In the event of a problem the company plans a remote control center that would take over the vehicle and ensure it lands safely, he said. Chief Marketing Officer Derek Xiong said the vehicle has been flown more than 100 times at low altitudes in a forested area in Guangzhou, including several times with a person inside.